This is Rob Rold with a fishing update for the lakes in our area. Our two main reservoirs, Rough River Lake and Nolan River Lake, are both at Winter Pool. Crappie at both reservoirs are becoming active, and anglers were catching crappie anywhere from the surface to a couple of feet deep along the shorelines and around exposed brush piles. Ohio and Green Rivers have been high and muddy over the last week or so, but keep an eye on the levels, and when they get back down and stabilize and clear up just a little bit, uh, sauger are still being caught below all the dams. So that's an update from the Northwestern District. Please remember, hypothermia sets in real quickly this time of year, so always be be safe around the water, wear your life jackets, and plenty of clothes. This is Justin with your fishing report out of the Northeast. Fishing in the Northeast this time of year consists largely of sauger on the Ohio River, muskie in and below cave run, and trout in various stock locations. Muskie was starting to turn on in cave run tailwaters before the last cold spell, but I look for it to take back off with the next few days getting slightly warmer. Live baits are working, as do normally. But if you prefer artificial, try using green and silver or black and silver AC shiners. There are plenty of opportunities for trout angling across the district. Greenbow and Whitehall Park are scheduled to be stocked this week. The krill limit on both of these is 8 trout. If you are looking for something more scenic, where better to go than the Red River Gorge? Swift Camp Creek is this delayed harvest area. It's catch and release this time of year. Joe flies, super dupers, and power bait are always great for trout. That should do it for us in the Northeast. Good luck and be safe out there. This is Marcy Anderson with the Fishing Report for Southeast Kentucky. Winter trout stockings are currently underway on area lakes. Laurel River Lake and Beulah Lake in Jackson County were stocked at the end of January. Trout fishing on the Cumberland Tailwater can also be good right now. Trout can be caught on a variety of baits, including worms or night crawlers, corn, inline spinners, spoons, or small crankbaits. Winter time is also a good time for catching smallmouth bass on Dale Hollow, Laurel River, and Lake Cumberland. Jigs, spoons, or float and fly techniques are good options to try right now. Main Lake points and pockets are some good areas to target. With the water drawn down on Laurel River Lake, it would be a good time to mark habitat and structure that is normally underwater to help you plan for your future fishing trips. So as always, good luck and good fishing.